well-deserved standing elevation. Magical by Baez. Baez trying to score! What's up? This is Mark DeRosa. Welcome to the show. We are under the lights as the show gets you ready for another edition of Major League Baseball. Tonight, we've got a good matchup in store between the San Francisco Giants and the Cleveland Indians. Standing in, Cesar Hernandez. And we are set for baseball here this evening. for San Francisco. The second base. First delivery to him on the way. Hernandez. And a fastball here as he'll take a look at ball one. Seven one and oh. And back to back pitches out of the zone to begin the evening. It's two and oh now. Now here's the pitch. Ball that took care. 67 degrees our game time temperature. Taking all the way, it's three and one now. Now that's a really curious pitch selection. 3-0 and turned to the slider. You have to wonder if maybe he's lost the feel for his fastball. Full count now, three and two. Hit hard on the ground towards second. Murphy's got it. And there's one away. Into the box now, Hunter Pence. As he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Pitch on the way. High in the air out towards shallow right. Nick wins under it. He hauls it in without any trouble, and there are two away. So stepping in, Mike Yastrzemski. First chance for him here in the top of the first with nobody on. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. First pitch hack in here, and that's the first strike. Two out, nobody on. Lied hard to center field. Tapia will get there and he puts it away to retire the side.
Stepping into the box, Jose Ramirez. He'll lead things off here in the bottom half of the first. The third baseman, Here it comes. Ramirez. Pulled toward right center field. Henniger has it, and it's a quick out number one. Stepping up to the plate, Tyler Naquin. Tyler Naquin. First pitch of the at bat. And he misses inside with that one. Ball one. One out, nobody on. That evens it up, one and one. Naquin is a very well-regarded defensive outfielder. It used to be that fielders were evaluated mostly by the eyeball test and simple stats like fielding percentage. But of course, these days, there are many more advanced ways that help determine a guy's work in the field. And in his case, he shines in many ways. You know, Matty, for me, I think he does pass the eyeball test. I know that you have to true. look at all the numbers That's and the analytics stuff. to really appreciate That's a ball true. player like this. But man, does he come to work every day and play hard. A ball and no strikes. Wouldn't mind a pitcher expanding the zone a little bit more and using his aggressiveness against him. And a strike to even the count. One and one. Nice adjustment out on the mound. Overthrew the first one a little bit, but got on top and let that ball rip right out in front of him. Line towards center field. And that finds some outfield grass. It's a base hit. So that hit extends the inning for Carlos Santana. Batting four. The first baseman. Carlos. So now Carlos Santana. Santana. As he pops the first pitch foul behind the plate. He takes his first cuts in this one with a man at first and two away. On its way, the 0 1 pitch. Another one fouled off, and he's quickly behind 0 and 2. Lindor is off of first with two away. And this one's in the dirt. And he'll rein it in as the count moves to one and two. In the dirt here. But it won't skip away far enough for the runner to advance. Now a throw over to first, but he's safe at first as he gets back in time. The 2 2. Off and running is Lindor. Just tongue in there on that one. A runner on first with two away. Now a throw over. Throw won't get him. The 2 2 one more time. And this one's in the dirt. And a heads up play to get back to first as he wisely hadn't gotten too far from the bag. The 3 2 pitch. Hit pretty well out toward right center field. Giving chase is Hediger. He tracks it down, and that will end the inning. set for the start of the inning and next to bat will be the outfielder Mitch Hanniger popped him up Murphy ranging into the outfield he gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning Dan Vogelbach is next the first baseman ready to deliver here's the first pitch swing and a miss that one tied him up Boy, that's just about in the catcher's glove there. It's 0-2. Boy, so far early into this one, this guy's pitching really well. And I'm a big believer in body language. He's getting the ball. He's working really quick, keeping the ball down in the zone. And if you take a look at this guy so far early on, 
a lot of positive signs. He looks like he brought his good stuff in this one. So he racks up the swinging strikeout on the breaking ball. Daniel Vogelback goes down for out number two in the top half. And that misses for ball one. And a fastball runs a bit inside. He's down 2-0. Now the pitch. Swung on, missed two and one. This pitcher's bringing it with some high velo. You better get that front foot down early and get ready, or he's going to throw it right by you. Unable to get the bat around in time, and the count evens at two and two. Tough curveball that time, but he's able to make a little contact to keep this at bat going. Almost got him to go around, but instead it's ball three. Wow, that pitch wasn't even close, and he almost chased it. Found the pitcher. I'm gonna... Got him looking, and that'll do it. The inning is over. Ready to go for the last half of the inning, and up next, postseason record holder Daniel Murphy. Daniel Murphy. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Samarja has become known as a starting pitcher that frequently works deep into games. The kind of guy you want on the staff when your team needs some rest because he tends to eat up innings all by himself. Matt, every team is looking for a guy like this. In a day and age where we're going to the bullpens more early and more often, you need at least one or two guys into the rotation that have the chance to get you into the seventh or eighth inning, and he's definitely one of those guys. And he takes strike three cold on the clear. fastball. One gone. The designated hitter, Pablo. First Pablo. delivery to him on the way. Hit sharply on the ground. Right to him. Throw on to first is in time to get Sandoval, and there are two gone now. In now for Cleveland, Rymel Tapia to try to make something happen with two gone in the bottom of the second. Tapia. Samarja has his target. First pitch on the way. The 1-0. This is hit high in the air out toward left center. Giving chase is Hedegar. He can't get there, so the inning will continue. And he is in the second with a two-out double. Standing in now, Domingo Santana. As he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. Opportunity for him here to pick up that runner from second with two away. Oh, and he's really getting the better of him now. It's strike two. Bottom of the second here with no score. In the dirt here. Good job there as the count goes to one and two. A ball and two strikes. Man, this at bat has changed quickly from 0 and 2 now to 2 and 2. A good job of plate discipline by this hitter, not chasing those pitches just off the plate. Good job to spoil that one away, and he stays alive. Two out here and a runner at second. Swing and a miss, and that ends the inning. Next to bat for the Giants, Brandon Belt. 7-8-9, bottom of the order set to go here in the third. Out in front of it, strike one. The wind up and the 0 1. Swing and a miss, and he's in trouble now, 0 and 2. Interested to see what the pitcher goes to now after getting that late hack on the. There's a swing and a drive hit well out to right field, and that is off the wall. The throw into second. Not in time, and he's in there with a double. Batting it. The football. 
Wilmer. Ooh. Into the box now. Wilmer Flores breaks his bat as this one's popped up. And no one will get this one. A one pitch on its way. No one out with a runner at second. Change up. Good pitch there. One and two. Probably better that he let that pitch go anyway. After seeing a lively fastball in the pitch before, it's pretty hard to sit back enough on a well thrown changeup. That's in there. Base hit. Now the throw comes quickly into the third baseman, so they're at the corners now to begin the inning. Batting up. The captain, number 28. Buster. Here's Buster Posey now. And he fouls this one off. And they're runners at the corners now. Ball. Outside at 94, one ball and one strike. Everyone in the ballpark knows what the pitcher's intentions are in this situation. Great job at the plate to lay off a tough pitch. And there's a base hit as the run will score from third, and the Giants break out on top here, one to nothing. Now that second base hit. At the plate now, Cesar Hernandez. And he hits it hard to the right side. Gloved by Murphy. One there. Throw on to first won't be in time, so they just get the one there. So digging in now, Hunter Pence. He flew out in his last at bat from the stretch. Oh, one, here's the pitch. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Bouncer up the middle. Step on the bag for one. Relay to first in time. And just like that, this side is retired. Coming to the plate now, Alex Avila. He'll get to take his first cuts here. The catcher, Alex Avila. Pitch on its way to Avila. Oh, and he misses it. The back, the third baseman, Ramirez. Into the box, Jose Ramirez. As Samarja will get ahead of him here with strike one. It was a fly out for him to start the home first. And this one gets away. And costly as the runner will move into scoring position now. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. The one two misses for the second ball. Boy, that's a good pitch right there. The old old school guys would call that a little bit of chin music up and in. See if he can get him to move off the box a little bit. He's set. Here's the two two. And this one's in the dirt. Pro goes over to third and he's called out on a close play at third. Now the three and two pitch. Grounded to first. He's got it. And he is out on the tag. So bases are empty here with two gone. And into bat next, it'll be Tyler Naquin. Here comes the first pitch. Swing and a miss, and he's behind 0-1. Well, he kind of tipped his hand right there. His approach is obviously sitting on the off speed because he was so late on that first pitch heater. Fouled away. Way inside with that one, a pretty easy take there. 
So the intent of that 0-2 cutter right there isn't necessarily to get a swinging strike. If you get it, well, hey, that's great. But if you get it inside enough and he does make contact, he probably can't do anything with it anyway. The 2-2. Two -two. This should end the inning as it's sent out to second. Throw on to first gets him and the side is retired. All set for the start of the fourth. Man standing in the outfielder, Mike Yastrzemski. Fastball on the first pitch and it's taken for strike one. Yastrzemski was born in Massachusetts. He's in his rookie year here at the big league level. Oh, he looked like a caveman swing and a club on that one. It's 0-2 now. Protecting with two strikes. Went out of the zone that time, but he stays alive. Breaking ball swung on in the dirt. Avila corrals it, and the throw is there to record the first out. Coming to the plate now, Mitch Hanniger. Mitch Hanniger. First delivery to him on the way. Hit hard back up the middle and into center field as he's aboard with a one out single. Now back. To the plate now, Daniel Vogelback, as he'll go after the first pitch to him and comes up empty at strike one. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. One ball and one strike to the Giants' first baseman. That's a great take right there. Great pitch recognition to let that one go. Opposite handed, that's coming across the plate. You might think he got a shot to stay inside that one. And a good effort on the dive that time, but this will get by him for a base hit. And he is in there. Now that third baseman, Evan. In is the third baseman, Evan Longoria. Hit down the third. Oh, it's off the third. And this will kick off the third base bag. And they won't get an out from this as he's able to reach on a play that you just don't see very often. So now to the plate, Brandon Belt. As he swings and misses at a first pitch fastball, 0-1. It was a double for him in his first turn at the plate. And it's quickly 0-2. Looked like he was cheating a heater right there. A little bit too far out in front. Got to find a way to keep his hands back. The 0-2 delivery. One ball. He was Three even strikes. close to swinging right there. That was a stone cold take. The 1-2. Is a wave and a miss. He struck him out. So two away for the Giants here in the fourth. And up next, the utility the man, Wilmer Flores. Four. First pitch of the at-bat. Fouled off into the seats behind first. Hit weakly back to the mound. Throw to first in time, and the big inning is avoided as the side is retired. Ready to go in the bottom of the fourth. And with it comes Francisco Lindor to the plate. Things not looking very good so far in this one, but we're still in the middle innings. They're down by a couple of runs, and this would be the right place and the right time to get something going. The last thing they want to do is to try to come from behind and win this one in the eighth or ninth inning. Nothing in one count. Here it comes. No ball, two strikes. Hey, if you're going to throw a pitch like that to this guy, that's right where you want to miss. Any lower, and he'll probably make you pay for it. Ready to deliver the one and two. Good bite to that slider as he swings through it for the first out of the inning. 
Now back. So the base is empty here with one away. And that'll bring in one of the best on-base percentage players in the game, Carlos Santana. Here's the first pitch to him. Fly ball out to right field. Belt able to pull this one in for route number two. Daniel Murphy steps in now. 0 for 1 after he took a look at strike three in his first plate appearance. Yeah, today's game certainly don't get completely reprimanded for too many strikeouts, but no one likes to go down looking. And we'll have to leave it there as the play is made here to end the inning. So striding in, Buster Posey. He's in to get things going here in inning number five. Here comes the first pitch. Ball, that's out. The windup and a 1 0 pitch. Now a swing and a fly ball. Naquin's on his horse, but this will land untouched. Now the 1 and 1 pitch. Down the third baseline, but a foul ball, one and two now. Grounded to short, reined in. And the fifth oh. inning will start with a ground out, one away. So the coming to the plate, up. Cesar Hernandez. He reached on a fielder's oh. choice previously. Oh. First pitch has him dancing to avoid it. It's ball one. Changes up on him, but that's in the dirt for a ball. Pretty easy takes to start out this at bat. None of those pitches were even close to the strike zone. Glove by Santana, and he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Striding forward now is the DH, Hunter Pence. He comes in 0 for 2 thus far. First pitch coming, here it is. Sends that one out of play for strike one. Now the pitch. And here's a swing and a miss that time by Pence as he falls behind here, nothing in two. Popped him up. Santana is there. He makes the play and that'll end the inning. Set now for the bottom of the fifth, and standing in now the versatile Pablo Sandoval. The designated hitter, Pablo. Ready with the first pitch, here it comes. Nope, that's inside. Into his windup, here comes the 1 0. Hey! He's in complete command of his two-seamer right now. It's got great movement, great depth, running all over the place. This offense is going to have a tough time. Just behind the fastball there, two strikes now. The problem for the batter now is he's gotten so inside conscious after those first two pitches, anything on the outer half of the plate is going to look a foot outside. And a swing and a miss by Sandoval as he couldn't connect that time, and there's one away. Now in the box, Rymel Tapia. First pitch of the at bat. High fly ball out to straightaway center. Waiting on it is Henniger. Makes the play, and there are two gone now. Now at the plate, Domingo Santana. He was a strikeout victim in his first try. Yeah, he's got to put that one behind him, especially with runners in scoring position. Those punch outs will stick with you a little longer. Just gets a piece of it, strike one. No runs, three hits. No errors to this point for the Indians.
hit hard up the middle. A diving try, but he can't haul it in. It's through for a base hit. Now batting, Hector Alex Avila. Here's the catcher, Alex Avila. As Samarja will get ahead of him here with strike one. One for one after a single this first time up. High in the air out to center field. Waiting on it is Henniger. Makes the catch and that'll retire the side. Top half of the sixth about to get started, and that'll bring up the outfielder, Mike Yastrzemski. Infield shifted well to the right. Here's the first pitch. Now here's a fly ball. Well hit. Racing back, the right fielder gone to lead off the inning. Stepping in now is Mitch Hanniger. And on the first pitch, he hits it in the air to right. In comes Naquin. He gets there to make the play for the first out of the inning. At the plate, Daniel Vogelback. One run in and one gone so far this inning. First pitch hacking here, and that's the first strike. Classic case of the front shoulder flying open on that off speed. Needs to stay compact and stay in the big part of the field. Ramirez has a play. Two down. In now, Evan now Longoria. Perfect. He's one for two in this one. Ready with the first Longoria. pitch. Here it comes. He's ready. Here's the 1-0. Swing and a ball hit out toward right center. Naquin's on the move. He's there to make the play, and that'll retire the side. Into the box now. Jose Ramirez. 0 for 2 on his line thus far. I mean, what a diamond in the rough Jose Ramirez has been for Terry Francona and the Cleveland Indians. This guy burst on the scene in 2016, just absolutely set that lineup on fire. They were looking for a guy to bail out Michael Brantley and the production they would miss from him in the lineup, and Jose Ramirez filled that admirably. Lifted down the line and left, and no one can get there. It's a foul ball. The 1-1. One, one. Got him swinging in the dirt. The throw to first is in time, one down. And next will be the versatile Tyler Naquin. No hits in two trips to the plate for him in the ballgame. First pitch on its way. Counts one and oh. No runs, four hits. No errors to this point for the Indians. Line towards center field. Henniger is there, two gone. So striding forward now, Francisco Lindor. He singled in two trips to the plate thus far. Matty, he checks every box. Charisma, smile, hits from both sides of the plate with pop, defense, you name it. GM's dream right here. Into his windup, here comes the 1-0. Hit softly down the line at first. But a foul ball, one and one. Here's the pitch. Look out. Don't want to hit him there. It's full three and two. Three two counts are usually a time to challenge the hitter, but I think he'll be careful here. Shoot for the corner, and if you miss and you walk him, so what? 
That's better than him putting one in the seats. Scooped up. Off balance throw. Gets him. Nice play there as the side is retired. Ready for another shot now. Brandon Belt. And he'll get us started in what's officially the back third of this one. Brandon Belt. He's ready. Here's the first offering. Ground ball sent back up the middle. And the throw to first is in time, so the leadoff man is gone here to start inning number seven. Striding into the box, Wilmer Flores. One for two on his line so far in the game. pitch coming here it is line drive to center field that's in for a base hit and he's two for three the catcher number 28 Buster. and that'll bring up Buster Posey lifted in the air to center field waiting on it is Tapia makes the play and there are two gone now Ready for another chance. Cesar Hernandez. He got on top of one and was a ground out victim last time. Here's the first pitch to him. And that misses inside 1-0. Lots of hits given up, but so far no walks. At least he's making them work to get on base. Problem is, they haven't had to work too hard. Lifted the other way out to left center. Santana will reach out with one hand to make the catch on the move, and that ends the... Leading off the inning, Carlos Santana. And they'll need him to get something going here. Starting to run out of time. They haven't been able to score any runs as we're moving late into this one. A perfect time for this leadoff guy to try to get on base and ignite a rally. And this is taken in just shy of the warning track for out number one. At the plate, Daniel Murphy. He's 0 for 2 in the ballgame so far. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Lifted in the air out to left. Left fielder is on the move. He gets there, and that's the second out. Here's the panda now, Pablo Sandoval. He was sat down on strikes in his last at-bat. Yeah, and kind of shocked he got blown away with a fastball. You could tell he was late on that one. And we'll see if he tries to cheat to something, this A.B. No balls in one strike. Well above the letters with the fastball that time. Can't keep the weight back and he falls behind one and two. Bases are empty here with two men out. Skied in the air to straightaway left. Yastrzemski's got it for out number three. So it'll be the Giants DH. Hunter Pence. He'll have the first crack at it here as we start inning number eight. Here's the pitch. Right side, fair ball down the line. Throw into second, but it won't be in time, and it's a leadoff double. So they'll make a matchup move here and bring on a southpaw to face the left-handed hitter due up. Stepping in now, Mike Yastrzemski. Now a fastball runs inside and drills him. Oh, that's got to hurt. Now the Giants' number four oh, batter, Mitch Henniger. He's got a hit in three at-bats to this point. And there's the old slider from Perez at strike one. 
Perez is among a dying breed. Those lefty specialists whose roles are changing with the new rules around reliever usage. In the dirt. And it's not in time as he's in well ahead of the throw. So now two men in scoring position. A ball and two strikes to Mitch Hanniger. Hit to short. And there's one down now. But one's all they get as the run scores. At the plate, Daniel Vogelback. The potential second run of the inning stands at third. First pitch coming, here it is. Good deception on the slider there as he's way out in front. Well behind that fastball, it's a swinging strike. Hey, I thought he was going to work around him right here in this situation. But after getting two swinging strikes, there's a change of game plan. I guarantee he's going right after him. Got him to miss the breaking ball there. Daniel Vogelback has sent packing for the second out of the inning. He's set and the pitch. Men on third with two down. And Longoria swings right through that one as he's behind 0-2 now. Now time granted here at the plate as he'll step out of the box. Protecting on 0-2, so we'll do it again. And another foul ball. Here's another 0-2. Lofted in the air out toward right center. Nick Wooden's under it. And that's the third out. Settling in now, Rymel Tapia. He matches up with Jeff Samarja to get the inning underway. It doesn't look very promising so far in this one as we move into the later innings. Down by a bundle, it's time to get some base runners and hopefully a long ball to get them back into this one. First pitch on its way. After watching that one go by and a ball being called, you can rest assured he knows he's not getting away with another one of those. I guarantee you he's going to be aggressive on this next pitch. One and one to count. Now the pitch. Lifted the other way to left center. Henniger will slide over and put this one away. And that's out number one. Now with the plate, Domingo Santana. He singled his last time up. First offering on its way. High in the air out to center field. Waiting on it is Henniger. And that's the second out of the inning. Down Into back. the box, Alex the Avila. Only four Alex. outs remaining for them to try and rally back in this one. Samarja's is ready. First pitch on its way. There's a swing and a high deep drive headed for the right field corner. And that nearly would have gotten him on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. Here's a fastball that crowds him a bit, and it's one and one. One ball and two strikes to count. Looked like the fastball got away from him there. It's ball two. Popped up. And eight innings have come and gone now as the inning is over. A 
Bell set to start the ninth in this one and that'll bring forth the veteran outfielder Brandon Belt. Brandon Belt. First offering on its way. And we kick off the ninth inning with a swinging strike here. Nothing in one. You have to find a way to lay off that low sinker. There is just no way to do any damage. You're just looking at either a bruised shin or a ground out to the left side. And he falls behind 0-2. Nothing in two count and the pitch. Slider. Ooh, thought he had him, but it's one and two. Now a fastball taken outside here as it moves it to two and two now. And a swing and a miss. Good pitch there for the first out here in the ninth. Digging in once again, Wilmer Flores. He's two for three and looking for more here. Adam Simber enters the game with one gone in the top of inning number nine. Brandon Crawford will move into the on-deck circle now to try to get something started here with one gone in the inning. He's hitting to the Giants. Number 35, Brandon Crawford. And it's fouled away. Set to deliver the 0 and 1. Now a swing as he stays alive as this is fouled back right off the catcher's arm. Mm. Here comes another 0 2. This is on the ground over to first. And he'll take it to the bag himself for the out. Striding in, Buster Posey. It was a flyout for him in his last trip. First delivery to him on the way. Here's a little chopper up the middle. He's got it. Throw in the dirt, but a good scoop at first saves an error as this side is retired. So the lineup flips over and digging in Jose Ramirez no hits in three tries so far he struck out once Reyes Maranta takes the mound here not a save situation of course because of the big lead but he'll try to finish it out nonetheless. He comes set here's the nothing and nothing pitch Maranta. A native of the Dominican Republic. He throws a four seam fastball, a slider, and a changeup. And a changeup here, but that's taken low in the dirt for a ball. Down the first baseline, but a foul ball. One and two the count now. Here's the pitch. This one is fouled away up to the concourse area. Fouled off. Another foul ball, and this battle will continue.
Off speed pitch That's in the dirt as he takes it for a ball. Well, I think that pitch is the result of a lot of foul balls. He might have tried to do a little bit too much with it, trying to get him to swing through it, but it just ended up taking off on him. 2 2 pitch is fouled away. Locked in a good battle. Here comes another one. And he fouls this one off. The 2 2 one more time. Doesn't get the zone. Count full now. Hey, this has been an epic at bat right here. I don't blame the pitcher for a little nibbling right there. Maybe get a swing and a miss. He didn't bite on that one, so now we go full count. Count still full, three and two. Not quick enough that time, and he's lucky to get another chance. Count remains full. High in the air out to center field. On the run is Henniger. But the left fielder calls him off and makes the catch. And there's one away now. So here's Tyler Naquin. The right fielder, number 30, Tyler Naquin. First pitch of the at-bat. Wow, I can't believe the hitter took that one. The pitcher absolutely got away with a hanger. hit to first reined in and an off balance throw is in time as he takes one away wow now that is and that'll bring in the stop. switch hitting Francisco Lindor he comes to the plate as the last chance for his side two out here in the ninth he's set here it comes swung on and fouled as it looked to make it all the way up into the concourse area two out nobody on Fouled away. Last strike now for Cleveland. Pops this one up. Longoria is there. Makes the catch and the ball game is over. Hey, it's hard to win games at any point, but to win games on the road, especially in this ballpark, so they are very happy with this win. 4 nothing. the score tonight. The Giants led this game from the third inning on and never wavered. Jeff Samarja is credited with the win. Shane Our Bieber takes the loss tonight. despite working seven strong Giants. innings. So well, that just about well, does it for Mark DeRosa, no Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskers, and you've been watching with MLB Cleveland. The Show. No for more, We're make hit. your way over to no theshownation.com. Time of the ball game, two hours and 40 minutes. Tonight's paid attendance at Progressive Field, 35,041. The Indians thank you for your continued support and remind you to please drive home safely. Thank you and good night.